Let's learn how to add anchor points in Illustrator in this super simple tutorial. So it's important to remember in Illustrator, you can only add anchor points to the path and not the fill or the shape itself. So to better understand this, if you come to view outline, you can see now all the paths in the shapes that I've got on my canvas. So I'm gonna add anchor points. I can only add them to these paths and I can't actually add them to the fill or the block of the shape itself. So I've come out back into preview mode. So if I wanna manually add in anchor points, I'm just going to select the shape here and I'm going to switch to a no fill and stroke so we can better see this. I'm gonna select it with the direct selection tool. Now you can see here, I've got my four anchor points on the corners. All I need to do is come over to the pen tool hold and then come to the add anchor point tool. If I turn on my smart guides, we're going to view smart guides. This will now guide me and help me add anchor points to the path. And then from there, then all I have to do is click on the path and I can add as many anchor points as I like. From there, I press selection and there you go. So if I select the shape now, you can see I've got all my anchor points added here. Same thing for the circle selected, I can come into outline mode by going to view outline. So you can see I've got my four anchor points here. And again, then I'll come over, add anchor point, and I can add as many anchor points as I like. And it's exactly the same then for a complex shape such as the character I have here. So I can select this path or select the whole thing. I can see my anchor points here and then simply then I can add in as many anchor points as I like and I can use the outline mode and the smart guides to guide me. So I'm coming back into my preview. Now I'm just gonna quickly remove these anchor points here. So that's how to manually add anchor points. Now there is another technique you can use where you can add the anchor points in a systematic way with equal distance. So if I select the square here and then go to object path and I go to add anchor points, you can see now it's added four anchor points here, a perfect distance in the center of each of the paths. And I can do this again, I go to object path, add anchor points, and there you go. See, it's added more anchor points. I can do it again, I can do this as many times as I like. Go to path, add anchor points, and you can see it's added even more. Same with the circle. So I'll just switch this to a stroke. Go to object, path, add anchor points, and you can see now it's adding the anchor points equal distances from the existing points and adding in a specific number of steps. I can use this method for a complex shape, but there would be no reason to do this. It's more applicable for perfect simple shapes where you can easily halve or double up on the number of anchor points on a set path. So there you go. It's that simple to add anchor points in Illustrator to any shape, either manually or by using the add anchor points technique. So I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Keep on designing and I will see you for the next tutorial.